time spoiler warning if you're not up to date to Endwalker 6.2 well at least 6.1 I guess then you will be spoiled I know there's like some meme that he's gonna become tall and such but I don't think that's gonna happen but we'll see we'll see what happens if it takes some time Oh, so he did become taller. My apologies for keeping you waiting. He did become taller. <laughs> there you go. Vritra, I presume. Vritra. He become a beautiful man. Oh! <laughs> okay. Indeed, this vessel now serves as a host for my eye. Okay, okay. I was aware that the alchemists were busy preparing something, but this. Okay, wait, so they actually made a new body. They took another body. It's not the same one that is like. Uh, the kid that became taller. Okay, okay, they just made a new one. We couldn't well send you on such a perilous mission unprepared, Your Excellency. Okay, okay. We spared no effort in crafting the body, and I dare say you'll find it adept at wielding weapons and magics both. Okay, at least we know he's a tank. Twas our intent to present it to you sooner, but we could not bring ourselves to do so, knowing we could yet improve it further. Pray forgive us. There is not to forgive. I am grateful for this fine vessel and shall put it to good use. Again, I ask that you watch over Radzatan in my absence. The dangers we go to face are great and many, and I fear I will be unable to give matters here due attention. And in opening the Void Gate, there is ever risk that void scent will find their way into our world. Rest assured, we are more than prepared. Our soldiers have been training under Master Estinian. On my honor, we will not suffer a single fiend to pass. Good. So, think only of your mission, Vasha. Ah, but seeing as this is a different body, perhaps we should use a different name. Nay, Vashan shall suffice. Though I may have thus grown up, I am as ever a little brother to you all. Cute. As you say, as you say. Go then, Vashan. And best of luck. Have something for you as well. Oh yes. Oh uh, to to us. While you were gone, Orionje paid us a visit. As you may recall, he joined us on our foray into Alzadar's legacy in part to conduct research for the Loperitz. Ow. Research they were delighted to receive, and which has already inspired them to consider new ways to improve their own treasure vault. Or oh. As a token of their gratitude, Living Way entrusted a familiar relic to Orionje. Oh? Huh? Aye, the crystal, which showed the way to Meteon. Oh, what the fuck? The Loperitz no longer have need of it, and thus saw fit to return it to us. Oh, shit. Okay. Harboring the power of light, it could well aid us in our mission in the void. I don't remember. Does does it have the power of Hydaelyn still in there? And who better to bear Hydaelyn's gift than her chosen champion? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. I 
I shall keep mummy's crystal. If there is nothing left to discuss, then let us depart. Our boat awaits us in Akiali. Akiali? Okay, so since Petra's gonna be our uh, our tank. Okay, we're already four points. So. Actually, no, we we need the healer. Who would be the healer? Graha, you need to come back. <laughs> or Bianca, I guess. But what the fuck? <laughs> For saying. Okay. I shall now lift the seal. In the name of Al Sadal the Third. I cast open this door unto the void! Hmm. Go! Absorb the void gate! Got bigger. That's it. Okay. That's cool. Who is drooling? <laughs> it worked. We should have no trouble passing through a gate of that size. What can we expect to find after stepping through? On my previous foray, I emerged in a castle swarming with void scent. I was hopelessly outnumbered and forced to turn back. But together, I am confident we can hold our own. Upon our arrival, let us deal with any hostile entities and secure the area. The command of our mission, I leave in your capable hands. In the event of battle, I shall adapt my tactics to complement your own. Oh, okay, so you mean... That means that he can either be a tank or a healer, since we already have two DPS. Well, three with me. Wait, well. Should we require healing? I can provide it. It would be a welcome change of pace from my recent havoc wreaking. Oh shit, okay, so she's she's a healer now. Huh. Okay, okay, okay. Well, it's like in the Take past. Take heart, but... my friends, and have faith. We will brave this broken world and rescue my sister, Ajdaya. Ajdaya. Okay. 
for a back there, huh? Shit. Hmm. What the fuck? Okay. The spooky music! Whoa. Whoa, it's all corrupted everywhere! Okay, I stayed in quite literally a twisted place to avoid... T uh, stay focused. Avoidant could be anywhere. So I'm worried. Oh, they look depressing. Wait, is there? S Whoa, there's more behind. <gasps> what the fuck? What the fuck is this? Oh. Oh. oh, it's not over. So let's fire them. Hmm, she's quick on her feet, if nothing else, and she may still turn after her. Okay. Finally against her for real. So the gate Big is open again, again and delivered deliver the most mouth-watering morsels. Wait, is that actually? Okay, no. Huh? Whoa! Oh! Whoa! Like it. I, don't, I don't like how you look like I am Sarmelion, Archfiend of Earth and first of Gorbez's circle of fame. Such pleasure I will take in delivering you unto your grave. That's cool, they added voice acting. Oh, that's, that's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah.
This Scarmelione, he knew the gate had opened. And not for the first time. He and his brethren must keep watch over the portal. As we do ours, but to unflinchingly consume our fellow void scent. Like men, perhaps they form factions and fight amongst themselves. Mm. The question is, what will the minions do? Your mistress is no more, and the one who consumed her we slew in turn. Do you still mean to try us? <laughs> is that going to work, Estinian? I don't think so, bruh. I expect some void scent are more intelligent than others. Perhaps these ones simply do not understand our words. <laughs> Even beasts ought to understand strength. Okay, macho man, what the fuck? <laughs> there is much we do not know about void scent. If we are to survive their world, it would be wise to learn their ways. Show us the way. Let's proceed with caution. Pick up what we can. Don't overthink. We'll improvise as we go along. Uh, yeah, fuck it. <laughs> if that is your preferred approach, then very well. I shall defer to your adventurer's intuition. Uh, what? Now I wonder what the other one was. Whatever answer he would have gave us. Okay, so they're not gonna attack us? Like, what's up? I am here, sister. Finally here. And I will find you. I swear it. And I will kill you. No, I'm joking. No! Ah! <laughs> Well, not in this place. Like in the trailer and yeah. Ooh la la. You who are you? Not there anymore. <laughs> I, I, I try not to believe that's not Xenos, and also welcome Zels. He was the friend. The friend. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, ah! Uh! Well, I'm I'm a fucking idiot. Okay. I am, really. What the boy? <laughs> I see it now. The bottomless darkness. The insatiable hunger. The aura was present when we faced him in Garlemald. Okay, so like Yoshipi told us that we're not gonna be gonna see Xenos anymore, but there's still gonna be some stuff related to him in the story and It's, and you should be said it's not gonna happen, but I feel like he's gonna come back. What the fuck? Ah! Ah! <laughs> How did it come to be here? When Xenos died, its connection to the source was severed. It was forced to return to the void. Mm. Xenos. Mm. Yes, that was his name. And you are the friend, are you not? 
friend. That's a big word. Uh, <laughs> Gonna be bummed to us now? Oh. What the fuck? Oh. Oh. Mummy's crystal. Is that Heidelin's crystal? Yeah, it's mummy. The crystal of mummy. Oh, what? Oh, so we are going to take him back. Or, oh, we're taking out the bad of it? He's gonna become an angel? What the? What the? Oh, that's gonna be the girl that we saw in the trailer! <gasps> oh, what the fuck? What the actual fuck? Oh. Oh, she's a bay. But how? She's a bay. Oh. The light just now. Of course. Oh. And thus I am returned. Wait. Is that Heidelin? What the fuck? Ah? Ah? What do you mean, returned? Who are you? What the fuck are you? <gasps> what the fuck? I was once bound to the man named Xenos. Yeah? Did you fuck? Okay, I'm joking. His avatar, until you killed him. Yeah. Avatar, as in the void sent servants of Reapers. In the name of his hunt, Xenos took up that traditional Galian art. And through it, he forged a covenant with a being of the void to lend him strength. Covenant? A curse, more like. He stole my power. There was no equity in the arrangement. <laughs> of course. Of course. It's fucking Xenos. Of course it's not gonna be, like, equal to you. My uh. very essence was altered. Twisted into a tool to serve his desires. Pervert. Your previous appearance. This is your true form, then. Perhaps, perhaps not. What does it matter? I'm so fucking confused. Uh. Indeed, it doesn't. Regardless of your form, you are a void sent by nature. Uh, what's gonna happen though if she comes back to our world? So answer me this. Are you our enemy too? You're so edgy, Estinian. What the fuck? <laughs> you chill the fuck down. In this world, only a fool would attempt to devour a stronger being. Oh. And though it was as an avatar, I lost you once. I have no desire to lose again. Mm. Good enough for me. Okay, macho man. Now, you will answer me a question. Xenos called you friend. That's what you are? A friend? No, we know, we know. Uh, yes. Whatever Xeno may have said, I wasn't a friend. Not to you, at least. Not to you, at least not you. What do you mean? What what the what what do what do we mean by not to you? I'm so fucking confused. They this sounds boring. It's like, oh fucking let's go. I'm intrigued. So you're not a friend. Then what is it? What is a friend?
And she, she's just walking off like that. Okay. Okay, good talk. <laughs> <laughs> Even Ishtola, she's like, it's okay. Okay. Okay, like, what the fuck was that? Okay. See, it, like, I get they want to make the suspense and everything, but it did sound, it looked like unnecessary. <gasps> I want it. I want you to have a real name, an official name. I don't want to call you Void, Void Rob, Voidson, Dark World Voidson. Please, voice, voice acting, please. I don't want to be out loud. This is where I belong. My home. This endless darkness you call the Void. There was once light here, and it shone its warmth upon creation. The lands were green and the seas were blue. Life flourished. Before the war. The Contra Memoria. It must have been a terrible war indeed. It shattered the balance, causing darkness to engulf the world. Mm. All life was transformed into monstrosities, void scent. We are the natural order now. As light begat sin eaters, darkness begat void scent. The sun was driven from the sky as fleeting day yielded to endless night. In time, even land and sea lost their distinction. And though the spark of reason had died in us, driven by memory's shadow, we formed factions and carved out domains. This castle, for instance, its erstwhile lord must have abided in such a place once upon a time. If I may, the darkness in you is too much for any man to harbor. To my eyes, you are indeed a void scent. Yet your knowledge of the past and your demeanor mark you apart from your brethren. You are different. That much is plain. But in what way, I am unsure. As you say, I am void scent. But only in part. The darkness touched my mother when the war had only just begun, when I was still in the womb. Okay, so you're half white and half human or something like that? As a child, I looked like any other, but darkness coursed through me, and I ceased to age when I'd become a woman grown. Huh. So you're but like... that was then, and now. I may as well be one in full. Okay, okay. So you're like Grahatia that it's like four, three, four hundred years old, eight years old or something like that? <laughs> I prey on the weak and serve the strong. I live to survive. Nothing more. Forgive me. It was not my intent to pry. I realize, too, that I have neglected to ask your name. Oh, there you go. Finally. As we say mortal, you may call me Void Scent. That is liable to cause confusion. If you are not averse, we would address you by your true name. And call me what you will. I care not. Okay, so she doesn't have one then? Is it going to be Ishtala that's going to name her? How about... Zero? Why? Why Zero? Why? Meaning nothing. 
A name as fitting as any. <sighs> no, not nothing, but rather a beginning. For it remains to be seen what you will become to us. I don't know, man. I feel she could have found something better than just zero. But okay. So edgy. <laughs> As I said, I care not. Zero then. Milady. <laughs> I don't think it's a ni nice name. I'm sorry. Partnership? Are you saying you wish to strike a bargain? Mm. Well, Zero, while there is no end to the questions we could ask, it is only fair that we tell you our purpose in coming here. We are searching for a dragon. One who came to your world long ago. A dragon? Yes. Mm? Ajdaya is her name, and she is my sister. If you have any knowledge of her, I beg you share it with us. What's this? Did you say something? No. I thought I heard a voice as well. The keening of void scent, perhaps. The statues, it's... Huh. This place is as good as any. Let me have the ether now. Very well. Is it gonna be like fate? Like fate stay night? Are they gonna fuck to share their ether? I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> okay, so it's gonna be here trying to get the ether. Ah, oh, he's not dead. Huh? We struck it down, watched it die. Oh, maybe nothing dies here then. <laughs> oh, yeah. Fools. Death doesn't exist in this world. And I, mm. I am free to return whensoever I please. Mm, I see, I see. Oh my god, I just realized they have flowers on its head. Death doesn't exist. Of course, in the first, the power of light, of passivity, prevents life from emerging in the empty. But in the thirteenth, the power of darkness, of activity, prevents life from finding rest, even should soul be separated from flesh. Ah, okay. So unless one's essence is absorbed by another, it is possible to return again and again. They see it, something like that for him. For Ether, it is reminiscent of that creature's. Oh, <gasps> my mouth waters at the memory. What? The root. I must devour you too. Yes, I must. He angry. By my power, be reborn! Whoa. Whoa. Ah, big boy. Big monkey. Big monkey. It's another death they want. I say we give it to them. 
That's not gonna work though, huh? Hey! <clears throat> if you could lend us a hand, we'd be much obliged. Ha! <laughs> that you would. But you already owe me a debt. And until you make good in it, I won't lift a finger. Oh, <laughs> hey, my goodness. We'll speak after you've won. But know that if you lose, I'll help myself to your ether. <laughs> That's a bothersome duty should deliver to me this lavish feast. with all your might. It will make you that much richer and tastier. Mm. I love that the change it. We did like the change. Yeah. <laughs> There's no end in sight. A retreat may be in order. Oh, okay. Until you try, and I'm always happy to experiment. <laughs> Zero, is there no way to stop them from coming back? She won't share it. There is, but I have no reason to share it with exactly. you. Exactly, she's not gonna share it as long as <sighs> you don't give her either. No, Zero. You do owe us for one thing. Hmm? Your name. Oh, come on. Okay. You'll have your promised ether, but we are owed compensation for your name. Sure, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> My lady. <laughs> A name for which I did not ask. Yeah. But that I nevertheless did accept. Mm. Here you go. Let's go. Whoa. That was cool animation. Oh. Wait, Garlemald? <laughs> that that looked like the Garlemald, Garlemald uh, emblem. They've been crystallized. Haldo. Well now, that's quite the trick. like the same for Asians then. Satisfied? Completely. Oh. Come, my friends. With Zero's aid, we can defeat him. Yep. What is this? What have you done? But how can we, like, maybe she's able to do it, but how can we make them change into a crystal. We're not gonna use Hydaelyn's crystal, I don't want to. Now that I think on it, you owe me a debt as well. You may have missed your mark, but I won't miss mine. Okay, let's go. 
However, in a death is death. The death is Facial animation is pretty cool, especially with the eyes. To seal Aether in crystal. <gasps> Memoria! But how? How can you have this power? Power! Death has no place in this world. We are beyond it. And yet. Ah, Lord Golbez, you have sent me to my doom. Golbez? Curse you and your wretched flattery, and this abominable fate. Well, you should be happy that you can actually die. No, kind of. Hmm. Will they do something if we touch it? I guess not. Hmm. Oh. Vision! The big boy from uh, FF4. I didn't play the game, so I don't know the names of the characters or anything, but... You are welcome, seekers of might. But yeah, see, I know, I know at least how they look like, because of uh, the Cydia. Yep. I, Golbez, have called you for hither. Hmm. I, who would see us triumph in the coming crusade. That I may entrust you with command of our armies. Yes, yes, but one of the crews killed. In exchange for our loyalty, we are to feast on the finest. And so you shall, for if you are to serve me, you must be strong. Then honor the pact, and pray we are not disappointed. Very well. Behold. <gasps> no, 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 no! Savage horns. It pulses with life. Such vibrant ether. Holy fuck. Okay, is it already too late? Did they could This magnificent them? creature could only come from beyond the veil. Indeed. Feast, my friends. Feast and arise as my four arch fiends. Oh, As they are now, 
They can consume but a fraction of the dragon's ether. Okay, okay. That that tells us that they're still alive. Okay. Just as well. The creature may yet serve other ends. Fucking hell. Are you all right? Got some bad news, bruh. The Void Sense essence remains, but it has been sealed away, transformed into crystal. Memoria. Scam Leone called them. I take it they are connected to the war of which you spoke. Aye. Their use was central to the Contra Memoria, hence its name. And to my knowledge, the transformation is permanent. Oh! Oh, so... There's a... Is there no way that they can come back? I see. We thank you for coming to our aid. Huh. I repaid a debt, and in doing so ensured that I receive my own due compensation, which I shall have now. Yes, yes. I still have work to do, so I would thank you not to get carried away. Ether is the coin of choice. I appreciate the simplicity. <sighs> that makes us even, I trust. Right then. When you picked up the crystal, you experienced a vision, did you not? A dragon resembling a great Wyrm. I dare to hope that it was Ashdaya. Yeah, okay. Oh, sorry, I did a big yell. I thought that he would, he would get super mad or something. Even as it pains me to think she's been made to suffer. Okay, then there we go. <laughs> For the ambitions of this Golbez. We've been given much to consider. Let us take a moment to review what we know. Gulbis nuts. 